But uh, anyway, sorry, you you were. Gonna... Oh, I was going to say you <laughs> had an interesting idea about how they would use the controller in in uh yeah in recognizing where you are in the room. Yeah, in terms of. Or in relation to the PlayStation itself. Yeah, uh, and we talk. We, we were talking about this a while ago when the prototypes of the the prototype images of the controller started leaking right. out. Which and is it was what like, it ended up being, right? Yeah, for the Pretty most part, much. it was a little different, slightly, but not much. Right. Anyway, it it had a, a color bar at the top of it, like the PlayStation Move, where it's a pulsing color thing where it could see where you were. And I think uh, I was talking with Eric about that. We were at dinner and we were talking. It's like you know. The move might not be my cup of tea, motion, anything, might be kind of whatever, but if if this is just your attempt at, hey, throw it in the regular controller, just, eh, it's in there, do it. I mean, what does it hurt me? I won't use it if I don't right, want to, right. you know? So I was totally cool with that, um, but I was telling uh, Derek, now that it's official, now that it is, I mean, that is the controller, no ifs, ands, or buts. The that's, camera comes that's, with every system as well. The camera's there, and it's got, and, and the motion thing... Where it knows, it looks for where you are in the room, right. in 3D space. Now that that is mandatory, you're going to see some interesting stuff. I, I, hadn't, I hadn't thought about this before, but I was telling Derek, you know who will use this is Hideo Kojima. And I'm going to spoil it right now because I know he's going to do this. How but do you know? Hideo Kojima, he did whisper it to me. And, uh, no, it, Hideo Kojima is a person that always utilizes, what can the system do? Yeah. How do we turn this on them? You know, oh, the controller can vibrate? Have them set it down, and we'll say that the character in the game is moving it. Yeah, psycho it's madness. moving across the floor. Metal Gear yeah, Solid. he's the kind of guy who does stuff like that. So I'm calling it right now. There's going to be a confrontation in you know Ground Zeroes maybe coming up well, or some you, Metal Gear game. Once you told me about this, I got yeah. excited for in that Phantom Pain trailer. Yeah, we see what some people think is Psycho Mantis. Yeah, possibly him. Like, could you imagine if that's a PS5 maybe a title? Him. And- maybe it's him. Yeah. So let's say it is Psycho Mantis talks to you, they're going to have someone in the game at some point go, why are you sitting in the corner? What? Like, they'll know, because they'll know. They'll see the room, and it'll go, why are you sitting in the corner? And Psycho Mantis will say, why don't you come closer? What? Yeah, step closer to me. Look me in the eye, and then I'll tell you what you need to know. Can you imagine having that controller, and you have to, it knows where you are, you have to walk up to the TV you know what I mean? Yeah. You know that's that made, coming. That made total sense to me once you said that. They're yeah. going to they're gonna utilize some kind of interactivity within yeah. cutscenes. Yeah. Like he's done before yeah. in Metal Gear previous. Like, that's going to be awesome. Yeah. Um, so, stuff like that. So, I'm, 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 you know, with what they showed about the PS4, there was nothing make or break. It was yeah. just cool stuff. Uh, you know, hopefully it works.